Hi there, I'm Chris with Trigger Point Avalanche Training. Today we're taking a look at the Backcountry Access Tracker 3. It's a triple antenna digital avalanche transceiver. The goal of this video is to take you guys through the basic startup of this device and run through a single transceiver search with it so you can see how it operates. Let's get started. To turn the Tracker 3 on, slide the safety out of the way and turn the dial to the TR or transmit position. You get battery percentage and a systems check and the Tracker 3 is telling me with the TR that it's now transmitting a signal. I can also tell that I'm transmitting by this little blinking light on the side. To switch the Tracker 3 to receive, slide the safety and turn the dial to SE or search. When the SE blinks on the screen, the tracker is searching for a signal and it's telling you to conduct a course signal search. Once the tracker 3 has acquired a signal, it'll give me an approximate distance in meters as well as a direction to travel to get to the buried subject. If there's more than one burial, an icon will appear under the numbers to tell you about that. To suppress this signal with the Tracker 3, press down on the button on the face till you see SS. The transceiver is now searching the area for another signal and the suppression will hold for one minute. To turn the Tracker 3 back to send, turn the dial back to TR and you're now sending a signal again. Some other features available on the Tracker 3 include a big picture mode where the transceiver scans and gives you an idea on the number of buried devices and their distance from you. There's also a volume mute function on the device which completely cancels the audio. And finally, uh, there is an uh, auto revert function that you can turn on and off on the device. If you'd like to compare the T3 to other transceivers available, uh, take a look at the other videos on the website. Uh, if you'd like more information on the Tracker 3, uh, you can contact us through our website at www.trigger-point.ca. There's also great information on the Backcountry Access website or avalanchesafety.ca. Have a great day.